I can see how he thought it was covered. This is not the first time he has assumed that I would be killed by some of his employees. Hopefully one day I'll be able to teach him his lesson by putting a bullet through the back of his head. You're not meant to say what you wish for out loud. It won't come true if you do. That rule even works for wishes as cheerful as yours. That's outstanding. So this is just a giant clusterfuck of a mess then, with diamonds of belonging to nobody and Jerry being pissed yeah, off doing hard come. time. So that's outstanding. Nice. I like but I would say Ray needs some better employees if he continuously thinks that I'm going to get a water level fuck. If he continuously thinks that I'm going to die by his employees, you would assume that eventually he would just, I don't know, get some better employees, perhaps? I don't know. That's just me. I'm not even going to be able to outrun the cops, but it doesn't matter because we're here anyway. Mission complete. I get no money for that, and that makes me a very pissed off European because we Europeans like diamonds and money. Well, Nico. That was a whole lot of effort for no fucking reward. Story of my life. It is the story of a lot of lives, Becky. I'm getting used to hearing it. See you, Nico. I gotta go break the news to Gerald. At least I'm gonna be on the other side of some bulletproof glass to him. But you know what? I'm still fucking scared. Good luck. Yeah, I'd be scared too. Poor guy. So now we have to wait until uh, Jerry contacts us again, but we can get some assassination stuff done before then. Me, but I I'm not even trying to, like, steal the car from him. I was trying to get in and be a... That was stupid. That was dumb. Maybe I'll get a call then while I'm trying to escape the police again. Maybe I'll get a nice call from someone or a nice text and just be able to do the main storyline again. That was pretty good. That was a pretty good park job for... Swerving and swirling around and whatnot. Look at that beautiful sky. That beautiful overcast, kind of gloomy sky. I just need to find another taxi cab. Because this one is doing nothing. There you go. Oh, just my luck. It's always my luck that stuff like that happens. Let's see, any cabs? I don't see any over there. I don't see any up here. By the time I get to a cab, up oh, like, right th as a Mr. Fucking Tasty or whatever. Whatever the hell the ice cream thing. The cherry popper. Up. Oh, oh, hey, there's Pegarino. Nico, the shit has gone down. I need to see you. Come to the club and toot up. All right, Mr. Pegarino. I'll see you there. Well, there. I got a mission now. This cab better not go anywhere. There we go. All right. Going to the club and tutor. Get the fuck out. I'm not stealing the car this time. I'm good. Pulling someone against their will out of a cab is not illegal, so just remember that. When you want a cab and someone's in it, you just fucking way. take Thanks. them right out. You kick them out, pull them out, whatever you gotta do. It's fine. Apparently it's not illegal. The cops don't care. That's what GTA has taught me. Look at this don't guy. I yeah, I won't... Oh, hey, look, one last thing. In the strip club oh, where no oh, music's oh, playing. Oh, Nico. Good to see you. And you? How are you? Uh-uh. Fucking terrible. We got legal problems, all kinds of crap. You know how things have gone. I've heard some things. <sighs> you get close to your dream, then something holds you back. No. Well, commission or no commission, I ain't gonna starve. People don't want me around, they don't have to have me. But I know how to earn. I need a favor. Here we go. Fuck you! I looked out for you, and I'll pay good, real good. But I need you to do something. I need you to collect that H. I got some Russians who have a buyer. Russians? Yeah. Dmitry Raskolov. No, we've got the history. I know, but this is real. I need you. Real? What the fuck is real? Real because it's you? Real because it's my last chance! Then good luck. No! I need you to get that H. I need the money. I looked out for you, you know, people wanted to whack you, I said no. Now I need you, and I'll pay a lot of money. Listen, Mr. Pegorino, I already told you. I got no, history. No! You listen, you dumb immigrant fuck! I ain't asking you, I'm telling you, do this! Get over your principles. These guys don't hold grudges. Do it or you and me are gonna have a problem. Look, Phil will look after you. You won't even have to deal with the fucking Russians. 
He's waiting for you, down in Tudor. All right. I knew I could count on you. Hey, how about that drink? Yeah, I got the feeling they are going to hold a grudge and that this is going to erupt in some giant firefight, which is just going to be outstanding. Hey, Cav, where are you going? That was a lot of lightning. Hey! Yo, slow down there, buddy. Yeah, pull right on over. There you go. Thank you. Now let's go to uh, wherever. Do I have to get a call from someone? Where Assassin. Go? Yeah, apparently I do have to get a call from someone. What the fuck? I need to get out. Exit. Bye. Sorry. Apparently we just need to wait for some sort of call or... Yep. Outstanding. Roman. Roman, I have a problem. You've got the problem, Nico. I'm about to get married. I'm about to commit to one woman for the rest of my life. This is serious, Roman. I have been asked to work for Dmitry Reskolov again. There could be a lot of money in it. I heard you two had resolved your differences. He's on some boat in East Hook, right? What? You knew about this? He's on a boat in East Hook? Yeah, I, I heard you had forgiven him and we're working together. You're doing this deal, right? Now that I know where Dimitri is, I might just go there and take him out instead. Have you forgotten that he burned down your apartment and business? That he arranged your kidnapping? Now I have a better apartment, and I'll have an even better one if you work with him again! Promise me you won't do anything hasty, cousin. I have to think about it. Speak to you later. Okay, well, that's it, I guess. <laughs> I guess we don't really get a say in the matter, but hey, yeah, we'll just, uh... I don't know how long Nico has to think up, oh, but well, apparently not very long, because we get a call from Kate right after. Hey, Kate. I have a decision to make, and I don't know who to talk to about it. What's your choice, Nico? There is a man who betrayed me in the past. I am being asked to work with him. It could be very profitable, but it would mean going back on an oath I swore to myself. You shouldn't work with him, Nico don't need money. What is it going to change about your life? I don't know. It'll make things easier for me and for Roman. I'm not going to respect you if you compromise what you believe in for money, Nico. Goodbye. Alright, make your decision. So I can either kill him or get money. Which it doesn't really matter in the end game because... I'm not going to continue living in a GTA world. Now I'm getting messages. Nico! Blah blah blah. Uh... What the hell? Is that from Roman? Who's that from? That was probably from Roman. Messages. Yeah, it was from Roman. And then Packy. Trey's been trying to get hold of you. It's about your girl. Go and see him in the... Okay. I think that's a really old message. Probably. Because I don't think anything popped up because of that. But I think I'm going to go kill him. I think I'm going to go and what get revenge on him. Because Dimitri is a piece of shit. And therefore he should die. All pieces no, of shit should die. Some gas in here. And this cabbie is gassy too, apparently. Which is outstanding, so... I should probably steal a car and go down there. Like, that car. That car doesn't look too terrible. Even though the cops are right there. Fuck it, maybe they drew... Maybe they drove... No, they didn't drive far enough away. Oh well. Going over here anyway. Gonna take this car over here. There you go. We'll get some revenge, which we need to park like... Ow. Where the fuck do I even need to park to get this revenge? Who knew revenge was so difficult? Up oh, there we go. A dish served cold. Amazing revenge mission that'll probably blow up in my face. The Russians are loading heroin onto the cargo ship. Candy box? What the fuck? It's a random ass t truck. Well, thanks for telling me that they're loading heroin onto the boat. I don't know. Up, oh, up. Oh. He's supervising the operation in the ship's hold. Yep, there he is. That son of a bitch. I'm gonna shoot him dead. He's gonna be dead. Yeah, screw that guy. That guy's a jerk. How could anyone work for him again? The doors of the cargo hold are controlled from the bridge. Hopefully there's a lot of random armor and shit. Cause I know I'm probably gonna be getting messed up this entire mission. Possibly even dying a couple times. Oh wow. Find a way to get to Dimitri and get your revenge. Thank you, game. I will work on that. There are a lot of guys on that boat, I imagine. There are quite a few Russian dudes who would love to kill me. So we have to go to the bridge. Are they just going to start shooting me randomly? I'm going to the bridge. Are they going to shoot me if I... Oh, Dimitri doesn't want to shoot. Ah, oh, fuck. Yep. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, I already got fucked up. I didn't know if I was supposed to, like, wait or what. But that's great. Fuck you, dude. I need a better gun. Let's see. Here we go. Here's a better gun. 
Even if by slightly. I need to kill all the assholes I didn't kill behind me. There you go. Anyone else coming up? Oh, there's that guy. Yeah, there's a couple people out there. Ah, oh, man. Uh, can I get, like, that guy? There you go. Just, just spray into that. Any grenades? I do have a grenade. Frag out. Have fun. That's gonna go all the way over there, but it doesn't matter. Oh, hey, look at that guy. He, he joined the party right there. That is outstanding. I cannot kill this asshole. Oh, there we go. He's dead. Sweet. If I'm lucky, I'll be able to find, like, some really cool body armor and shit. Fuck. Ah, oh, fuck! Where'd that guy come from? There's another dude down there. That's great. Can I just, like, rocket this thing? That's a risky move. I'm gonna do it anyway. Oh, it worked! So much for risky. I made it work out, I did. Alright, here we go, here we go. I should pro oh, god, this guy, like, right fucking there? What the fuck? Go! Go to the box! There you go. Wow, what the hell? Why did he get to the side of it? That doesn't make sense. Get there. The box, like, moves. What a piece of shit box. Fuck that. I'm going right here. There's got to be, like, a sniper thing I can do here. Eh. Oh, wow. Missed. Missed. I just want to, like... Why can't I snipe from this position? I just want to, like, fucking be able to snipe. But it doesn't let me. Eh. No scope. No scope. Fuck it. I'll just go back to the good old assault rifle. Come on. One of these bullets has to hit that guy. One of these bullets has to hit that guy. He's like too far away to hit, apparently. I'm calling shenanigans on this. I'm calling, look at that. I'm calling legitimate shenanigans. There he goes, finally. Apparently I've walked close enough to get him. I don't even know if there's a dude up there, but... I'm shooting anyway. What's over here? Armor? Armor? Nope, no armor. Uh, one can hope, though. Oh, there's a random, like, guy over there. One can hope that armor does pop up at some point. Let's see. Let me go ahead and uh, shoot a rocket over there. Whoop! Wow, it hit a box in front of me. Well, good thing I wasn't close to it. That would have been bad. God damn it. I just saw him. Up, 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 up. Come on, nick him. Nick him, damn it. Up. Oh, I got the guy in front of him somehow. Somehow I got the guy in front and not the guy in whatever. God damn it. Fuck 